Okay, love bugs. So today I'm going to be doing a celeb Instagram baddie inspired look. We went ahead and installed this beautiful wig from start to finish straight out of the box. And this one is a glueless install. As you guys can see, she's super fire. So I teamed up with Hair Vivi for this look. And really quickly, I want to show you um, the inspo. Sorry, it's a little bit blurry, but I did. I was on... Um, Instagram and Lyra Galore did this cute little look where she did like two space buns in the front. Now she did add baby hair in the front of hers, which is my jam, but you guys don't like baby hair as much here on YouTube. So I opted to, you know, not have that. As you guys can see, she has the two space buns here and then the hair is beautiful and long. I'm sorry if you can't see it um, as clear, but you guys get the vibe. So I literally seen this as I was um, starting this install and I was like you know what I always do center part bust down center part straight you know down the middle so let's just have some fun and switch it up and that is what I did I did throw a little bit of a wand curl in it to touch it up after I did the whole install process we will be using some of my products from bdagbeauty.com including this glueless adhesive right here this is a light hold so in a few hours when it's time for bed I'll be able to pull this bad boy up and sleep in my bonnet because I just don't like sleeping in wigs these days. I didn't really show you what the wig looked like done without the space buns. Here is a look. It's been a little while so the wave kind of dropped. I just wanted you to see how beautiful and long and full the hair is. Of course if you want it straight go back to straight. If you want it to be a little bit more curled or wave you can do that as well. Hairline still holding up amazing. Looks absolutely beautiful, even more beautiful straight down. Just wanted you guys to see this really quickly. Now let's jump right into the video. In case I didn't mention, this is the inside construction of the cap. We're working with a fake scalp lace wig, pre-plucked for the gods, and her name is Victoria. She is a romantic wave, high quality human hair HD lace wig. Enjoy. So here I slowed down the process of cutting off the lace around the ear. This is something that a lot of ladies have a little difficulty with. It's best to use clips as many as possible to just section out exactly what you want to keep and leave down whatever you want to cut off and you'll get the perfect cut. I like to cut with scissors and go in a like around the ear motion so that the lace kind of frames my ear and it sits perfectly. Okay, so that was a lot of heat passes, but get a load of the difference. I would never put this much heat on my natural hair, but look at the side that is like raw with no heat added. And then look at the side that I pressed out. I literally bleaked out this lace with the help of Hair Vivi. I love the fact that this one came literally ready to go. Now let's cut off all the excess lace and I'm using an eyebrow razor. Everything is linked in the description box.
Okay, let's do a glueless install. I'm using a product from bdecbeauty.com. This is a gel-like glueless adhesive. Today, I tried something a little bit different by applying the adhesive on top of the lace. Again, this is a gel-like formula, so it's nice and thick and it doesn't run or move like, you know, some adhesives may do. It's also a very light hold product, so if you're someone who likes to get ready and get slayed during the day and remove your wig at night, this one isn't going to be too harsh on the hairline or your skin when removing it. All you need to do is add some water and you are good to go. And I love, love, love this one paired with our melt belt. Together you can pretty much bond the wig down with no heat, without a blow dryer or anything else. I'm taking my time from ear to ear. And then once I'm done, we're going to add that melt belt and proceed with styling the rest of the hair. Pro tip, when curling, crimping, or doing any like styles to your hair, it's a good idea to straighten the hair first. This is so that the hair is a little bit more sleek, if that makes any sense. A lot of times when you have like wavy texture hair or just volume in the hair and then you go in and get curls to the end, it can typically look a little bit more frizzy, frizzy or messy, if you will. So this is just something I've been doing a little bit lately to help to make the styles just look a lot more neat sleek and uniformed now we're going to go ahead and add our two top knots and then we're going to go ahead also and wand curl the ends yeah I don't wanna slow down, I don't wanna slow down, I don't wanna slow down till I burn out. I just wanna live fast, I don't wanna look back and say I could've done more than I did now. Sometimes it can be hard, yeah, it can be hard, yeah, it can be hard when you grow up. People fill you with doubt, you start thinking about what you're gonna do now. But we only go on chance and go on life to live. And it's do or die, gotta make it count, so lose your worries. Your problems go on Until my whole body burns out I ain't never gonna slow down It ain't no thing to do my thing, it's what I did the best yes, I copped that crib and bought two chains and then I hid the rest mm -hmm. And it's okay to do your thing, but just don't do the most uh -huh. I put my friends in that old Benz and took that to the coast that. It ain't no thing to do my thing, it's what I do the best yes, I filled my mattress, paid my taxes, then I blew the rest right. And it's okay to do your thing, but just don't do the least uh -huh. 
I quit my boss and cooked that sauce and fed that to the street. Uh, sliding in here like a wet flow. Already fried from the get go. Alligators look like echo. Everything I do, they echo. Big facts, my bank on big man. My drip too wet, that spit can. Yo, bitch, swap me like Q tips. Hold that shit there like dip can. No rehearse, need no reverb. Hold your lip, don't say three words. Quick trip to get that lick lick. Broad tree fur if you prefer. Quick ride, no time, I'm in there. She clockwise, real good skincare. No tick tock for that caca. They know that love don't live there. I can't roll dice on your plan. Red Rover, I don't hold hands. Get fortune from my foresight. Investment brought me four bands. Don't roll rage, I get roll head. We'll wheel all by your forehead. Them city john be like he lit. Them country girls be like go head. If I ain't that man, then I gotta be more. Okay, so we are done with this look. The next clip, I'm not gonna be in any makeup, but I did forget to share with you guys um, the packaging and all of that. So this is one of the ear tabs. The other one is on the floor. I'm gonna grab it up too. I think I'm gonna save this one and add a couple to like um, like a sandwich bag, like make a collection of the ear tabs. You know when you, t when you cut the um, ear tabs or the sideburns off? Because I've been seeing lately people use those and like glue them on to make baby hairs whenever they do like natural hair hairstyles like ponytails and like um cornrows and stuff like that i want to try that look because you guys know i got a big forehead and i don't have a lot of baby hair space so i'm going to start collecting those and eventually i'm going to share with you guys a ponytail look where i'm going to use those and like literally glue those little scrap pieces to my head so that just came to mind and i wanted to mention it but as I also mentioned, this one did come from Hair Beauty. Love the fact that their packaging is navy blue since that is my favorite color. Even the tissue paper has their logo and bows in the gold. Super nice and pretty. Inside were two dust bags. I think the first one, this one here, um, is what the wig was in and it does have the logo on there as well. It's like a jawstring dust bag. The second one is a little bit smaller than the first and this is kind of like a little goodie bag. Inside you did get two, uh, you got the baby hair brush in the color black and then you also got two dolphin clips. Love, love, love the hair and how it held up. Now let's go ahead and jump into the outro. Disclaimer, I'm not wearing any makeup. So let's get into it. So now today we rec replicated um, a look from, was it Miracle Watts? I mean, I screenshot it. Lyra Galore, actually. And I think this is the hairstyle she did today. It showed up on the timeline today. Not sure if you can quite see it, but she just did two of these fun little buns up top. And then she did some fun baby hair. You guys on Instagram or, or where are we at? YouTube. Don't typically prefer the baby hair. So I kind of left that out and more so just focus on the style itself so again that was the like the height or the focus of the look and then in the end i just wanted to tame the hair but still keep it a little bit fun with a wavy pattern not necessarily trying to get curls but just kind of just giving like a body wave type of vibe and this is good for me i am going to add a little bit of serum to cancel out any frizz and we are good to go. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup off camera. But I just wanted to show you the hair as of now. Of course, everything looks better when your makeup is done. Be sure to check the description box for details and everything you need to know about this one. Thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Smooches.